Mainly, I couldn't just catch a break with all that madness, but I feel like Target and Little Caesars. Now I look like a bloody mess because of what happened in Baskin Robbins. I will tell how my job went, but I need to wipe off the scars and bruises off my face. I'm back. Now back on topic. I've got beaten by yet another customer who I made fun of him being a cat. That was even worse than that yellow turtle who roasted me. I also have seen returning customers at certain jobs I got. The rest of the customers were off. Well, it was fun while it lasted. I got fired 20 times in a row. I better not get fired 30 times or I will make 50th in the halfway point. So, where should I work next? I know. I'll get a job at Kroger. Welcome to Kroger. How may I help you? May want to get 3,000 better chips. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, you fat slug. That's about a whole lot of bag of chips you're ordering right now. You can at least order one or two. I don't care. Look, I'm super hungry. That's why I'm getting this much chips. And I'm actually a hut. Now buy me some chips. No. Like I said, that's way too much for you to have. Besides, think about the people who wanted chips as well, but they can't because of you. I mean, even if you're hungry, you can still buy one or two. You don't want to be a fat hut for the rest of your life, do you? Dude, I'm always like this. I spent much of my time sitting, eating and watching various shows put on especially for me. This sedentary lifestyle is what led to me becoming fat. Now, can I please get my 3000 bags of chips? You have 10 seconds to leave this retail store or else this slug's head will be chopped into bits. I better get out of here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Welcome to Kroger. How may I help you? I would like to get a bag of fresh red apples please. I'm sorry, but all of the apples had been rotting down. Come back when we have more fresh apples. No you're not. I can see those apples in that wooden barrel behind you. They look 100% fresh to me. You must be colorblind. You're actually looking at the green apples. Not the red apples. Colorblind? Sir, I can assure you that I'm wearing glasses on right now. And I'm looking at the red apples, not the green apples. You can't tell apart between these two. Yes I can. And I bet those glasses you're wearing are making your vision dumb. Says you, you're wearing glasses too. And I bet you're saying the red apples are rotting because you won't give me the bag of apples. Tell me the reason why. Fine. The reason why I'm doing this because you don't need the red apples. Get the green apples instead. Wow. Your main reason as to why you won't give me the red apples is because you think I should get green apples. How dumb of an employee are you? Welcome to Kroger. How may I help you? I would like to get bread and butter please. Okay, give me your earrings and I'll get you the bread and butter for you. What? There's no way I'm giving you my earrings. Look, there's a lot of things I can give out to, but not my personal belongings. Too bad. Give me those earrings or you won't get the bread and butter. I told you already, no. I'm not going to give you my stuff just for two items. Get over it already and get me what I want. Fine. Then can you give me your dress? Wow. You're such a jerk and a pervert, you know that. I'm going to Walmart instead. Welcome to Kroger. How may I help you? I would like to get three watermelons please. Okay. But what do you need three watermelons for? I don't think you can eat all of them at once. Oh, I'm not going to eat them. These are for an experiment that my family is doing a 500 rubber bands watermelon challenge. What? So you're saying you'll get 500 rubber bands just to put it on a watermelon and expect it to burst out? That sounds pretty messy. No way am I getting you three watermelons now. Oh, come on. 
This is something my family suggests on doing. Plus, we've seen people do it on social media, and our family thought about doing the same thing. That's why I'm here, and my family is waiting for me. You know, there is this old saying, don't try this at home, right? You should have thought about it for you try to believe what you see on there. Of course, I heard about it. A few times actually. But I don't see what adding 500 rubber bands on a watermelon has to do with anything of this. Once again, we're just experimenting, not having fun. I'm still not giving you three watermelons for just a stupid experiment. And before you go and say anything, don't even think of trying to say what I think you are about to say. And what would that be? And of course, you said it. Get out of here you blue-headed kid. Wow. Stubborn employee you are. I'm going to another Kroger. I better not see you in my skin again. Welcome to Kroger. How may I help you? I would like to buy five fruit cups, four bags of spring salad mix, and nine Caesar salad bags please. Okay. That will be $30.45. Okay. I'll have that for you in. Shoot. Mr. Employee, I only have $7.30. Then choose a different item to buy. Hold on, I remember that left the rest of the money at my house. Can you give me a few minutes before I leave so I can return it? What? No. You should have gotten all of your money before you came in this store. Get something else. Oh, come on. I'll just be back for a couple of minutes. Just give me a chance. No. Either you buy something else or you will get out of this place right now and don't come back. But, 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 but. No buts. So what will you do now? Yeah, I showed him. Agent Trout, just what was that did I saw? I cannot believe you are being rude to the customers. That is it. You're fired. Now get out of here.